Paul Asola, a great bit of play by Julianne Russell to evade Kira Smith on the left flank. Finds Roll Asola in behind, who just manages to pick out the bottom corner at the near post to evade Rachel Kelly. And United are a goal to the good in the early stages here at Amen DC Park. Solar asking questions of the Bose defence. Finds Kay Thompson. Manages to find his way to Russell. Can she get a shot away? She can. She nearly gets it in at the near post, but it's well blocked. Options ahead of her. Finds McKee, who keeps the ball in. Has bodies in the box. Aim towards Russell. He gets a shot away, and it just flashes past the post. Another dangerous chance for United. And has Knevi ahead of her. Aims for Olasola. Nevi finds McKee inside and she takes a shot and it's an excellent goal. What a strike. Pick that one out. Another brilliant goal by United. This time it's Lindsay McKee, 25 yards out. Manages to just scoop it out from underneath her. Ola Sola up against Ruddy on the far side. The ball bounces in and Russell just can't find the bottom corner. It looked destined to bounce into the bottom left corner, but somehow it evades the post. Against Cork City, a Turner's cross last year from a free kick, swings it in. As it's three goals to the good for United now, as Jenna Slattery with her first corner of the game finds Isabella Belatic, and she makes no mistake from the penalty spot and finds the top left corner. And it's United 3, Bohemians nil already at Eamon DC Park. Costello plays it down the wing. It's checked inside by Thompson who Russell still manages to retain the ball it's played across goal and United managed to make it four and it's Therese Kenevi who stabs it home at the back post four goals to the good for United and you have to say they must be home and host already in the first half another excellent bit of play by Julianne Russell goes for Olasola has space flashes it across goal as Costello once again advances Finds Russell, forced back, picks out Slattery, picks out a shot, and it's well stopped by Rachel Kelly. And United take a four goal advantage into the break at half time, and it has been an absolutely outstanding performance all round by United. Both have caused threats of their own with. Alana McAvoy in particular going close on a couple of occasions, but United will be absolutely delighted going into the break. And McKee manages to find Russell with what initially looked like a speculative ball. Not many options in the box, but she manages to pick out Slattery, who gets a shot away and it trickles wide of the far post, but another brilliant United attacking move. Russell in possession. Has McKee on the penalty spot and it just evades the bottom corner. Looks destined to ne nestle in the bottom corner, but McKee unlucky not to extend her tally there. Three central defenders, but after a triple sub at half time, went for a more conventional four at the back as Costello is in possession, aims across in towards Russell as she manages to just not find the goal in what looked destined to end up in the back of the net particularly after Rachel Kelly jumped past there who's looked lively since coming on can't quite get the ball out of her feet but it doesn't matter as Russell tries to find McKee and she's taken down just on the edge of the six yard box and United have a penalty and a chance to make it five and she's managed to strike the upright. No doubt she struck it cleanly but just ever so slightly too far right. And Ball's in possession through Brennan. And the referee's full time whistle goes. And that's that's that. Galway United 4 Bohemians nil. A fantastic performance from Galway United at Amy DC Park in what's been their first game of the season here this this league campaign. Brilliant start for United. Rola Olasola opened the scoring for the Tribes women after 12 minutes. Lindsay McKee made a two from long range. And then Isabella Belatic and Therese Kenevi 
added further gloss to the scoreline just before half time. Second half, not much to note apart from a missed penalty from Jenna Slattery, but it's fair to say they were already home and hosed when they went in, went in at the interval. Brilliant performance from United, and then now they can look ahead to their next game, which is against Glentorn Women in the Avenue Sports All Ireland Cup.